Hello everyone. I am Ranjit from Informatica Global Customer Support. In this video, we will see how to create a custom workflow in CDGC. The agenda of today's session is what is custom workflow? What are all the workflow conditions in cloud application integration? What are all the task actions in metadata command center? And then we will see on the steps to create the custom workflow along with a quick demo. Custom workflow User can configure custom workflow based on some events. Custom workflow will be built in cloud application integration and these can be accessed in metadata command center. User should be able to import the workflow from application integration to metadata command center. On selecting a particular workflow, user is able to see the configured workflow on the workflow renderer along with all the tasks. User can be able to edit each task and fill parameters for the selected workflow. Cloud application integration workflow conditions. Processes with only human tasks will be supported. Workflow must have milestone step immediately after the start step. Process must have allow anonymous accesses checkbox enabled in start step. Process must not have subprocess. Process must be published. Start step must have input fields of type human task assignment to assign the dynamic roles to each human task while configuring in metadata command center. MCC configuration conditions. Configure at least one action of task outcome as publish. Assign all stakeholders role to any of the input fields so that associated stakeholders can view ongoing workflow tasks. Asset name as the asset attribute for the input field. Task actions in metadata command center. In metadata command center, we configure the actions to be done for each human task outcome. The actions can be asset lifecycle status update or discard the draft. Two new action items in task outcome, no change and discard draft have been introduced as part of this custom workflow. For reject and discard actions, select outcome as discard draft. Privileges required for triggering the custom workflow in CDGC. For application integration, user needs to be provided with read access for assets and console administration monitoring view application integration console access for the features. And for human task, user needs to be provided with the read access for assets. And as part of the upgrade, existing tickets should be cancelled and the workflows needs to be updated with the latest custom workflow. Now we will see on the steps to create a custom workflow with a quick demo. Now we will see how to import the add-on bundles to cloud application integration. So to do that, we will create a folder in application integration first. To do that, click on explore and then click new project and provide a name here. Once the folder is created, navigate to administrator and select on add on bundles and once it is selected, navigate to uh, available bundles and search for data governance. So once we see this data governance and catalog workflow bundle, click on data governance and catalog workflow bundle. And here we will see an option to copy the bundle content to cloud application integration. Click on the button and select the folder which we have created now. So this will import the Informatica provided added bundles to the folder which created in application integration. So now we can see like bundle data governance and catalog workflow bundle was copied successfully. So now we will be able to see the processes in the uh, folder CDGC add-on bundles custom workflow. We will see on the steps to create the processes in a metadata command center in the next demo video. We would love to hear feedback from you. Thanks for watching.